Hey friends, Griffin here. I, right now, I'm inside one of the control rooms here at Bloomberg. This is the one where they master control the show with all due respect that I work for on Bloomberg Politics. This is where they decide what graphics and what things to cut to in the studio. A lot of really complicated stuff in here that I don't know how to use, because usually I'm just on the road shooting pieces. But this week, they actually had me in the studio. They gave me an earpiece and uh, a lav mic and did a little interview with me about this short documentary piece I just produced this week. I was in South Dakota covering the Senate race there. It's heating up, and I told the story of the Democrat who is catching up in the polls, and it might be because he sings at his campaign stops. So you should check out the interview they did with me and the completed documentary piece. It's five and a half minutes, and I think it's a, an interesting story. I tried to do some things that I don't often do. I started it with a little bit of time lapse. I did some uh, motorized slider shots. I even used my Blackmagic Pocket Cinema camera for a few shots, which I haven't used much. And the whole thing is in 4K. So if you watch it on YouTube, you could choose 4K if you have a monitor or TV big enough and check it out in all that glorious resolution. So I just want to tell you about those two videos uh, so that you know that I'm not completely slacking. I'm doing something this week, and I'll, I'll see you again soon. There's 311 incorporated towns in South Dakota, and Wyland has visited all of them. He's actually on his second tour right now. Every nook and cranny of our state, from, from Peaver to Pukwana to Pringle, <laughs> from Wakanda to Wakota to Wataga.